three. Action. Hello, Brian. Hello, James. Andrews. In the Brad's party. <laughs> What was your first impression of Rose? Rose is a very curvaceous and intelligent woman. <laughs> what will she say was her first impression of you? Tall, tall dark, and handsome. <laughs> what did you guys do on your first date? to the blue martini, had a couple of drinks. That's all I need to know. Oh, okay. That's as far as it went. <laughs> what is your favorite physical feature of Rose? Her dairy. La 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 What is your favorite thing about her personality? She's always up for whatever, we're, whatever comes to us spontaneously. She's always up for it. She's gay. Okay. Now, what will Rose say is her favorite physical feature about you? James, earmuffs. <laughs> La, 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 this thing la, la, right down here. <laughs> oh. <No. laughs> what will she say is her favorite thing about your personality? That um, he's uh, fun. All right. What is something you do that irritates her the most? Uh, it would be during an argument when I maybe don't hear out her side and don't take her perspective on the The first time we did this video, you said it's when you don't respond. So which that one is too. it? Or don't respond to her questioning. Which one? When I don't respond to her. Okay. What is something she does that irritates you the most? When she questions me nonstop. <laughs> okay. Who is her celebrity crush? Wolverine. <laughs> Who is your celebrity crush? Selma Hayek. <laughs> If you could choose one meal to have over and over, what would it be? Pizza. Last time you said my sister. <laughs> well, that too. <laughs> if Rose could choose one meal to have over and over again, what would it be? Pizza. She says it needs all the basic food groups. That's all in her theory on it, at least. Good. If Rose could travel anywhere in the world, where would it be? I'd like to say the Philippines, but that's not accurate. Hawaii. We had fun when we were there. We didn't spend a lot of money. It was a good deal. It was a thrifty, good, good time. <laughs> If you could travel anywhere in the world, where would it be? Do I want her to get this question wrong? I will say Brazil. Rio de Janeiro. Sorry, Rose. Who wears the pants in your relationship? You split them? It depends on what area our life It's pretty much down the middle. Okay. What will she say is the best and worst gift you've ever given her? 
This one's an easy one. You might want to splice in the last answer to this one, James. <laughs> the worst gift would be uh, Mother's Day. We were going, getting ready to go to the lake and I bought her some uh, sundress. tags on there and she wasn't happy about that or the gifts for that matter. And she returned them before we even went to the lake that weekend. Oh, and what was the second part? You bought it. Oh, and I bought it again. Because <laughs> it was on clearance. She put it on, didn't like it, and returned it again. <laughs> Have you ever been caught in the act? Details, please. Last time your answer was lame, you said no. You're pretty discreet. How about a different question? What would you say her favorite position is? And vice versa yours. I'm going to walk away. Uh, she, she likes more of the amplexus, which if you can hurt that from scientific terminology, it would be more of the Fro uh, froggy style, yeah, which doggy style. Okay, there you go. All right, James, you're good. <laughs> Amplexus, James. Amplexus. Might have to look that one up. <laughs> <clears throat> I don't know if his uniform is dirty yet. <clears throat>